The patient is a 54-year-old male, previously diagnosed with diabetic nephropathy. The patient has undergone a kidney transplant, but has since developed dialysis-dependent renal failure. A synchronous pancreas kidney transplant was recommended. Preoperative CT scans revealed extensive arterial calcification in the patient, with the exception of a segment of the left external iliac artery, which was atherosclerosis-free. A common arterial Y-graft will be used to provide inflow for both transplanted organs. To start, an anonymous artery Y-graft is taken from the deceased donor and anastomosed to the external iliac artery. The kidney graft is then introduced, and the renal vein is anastomosed to the external iliac vein. The renal artery is anastomosed to one arm of the anonymous artery Y graft, and the ureter is anastomosed to the bladder. The pancreas graft is prepared on the backbench, with the superior mesenteric artery and splenic artery anastomosed to a Y-graft harvested from the donor's iliac artery. The pancreas is positioned in the recipient, with the portal vein anastomosed to the vena cava, and the arteries anastomosed to the remaining arm of the anonymous artery Y-graft. This completes the arterial inflow for both the pancreas and kidney grafts, which originate from a common site on the external iliac artery. A Ruan Y limb is then constructed. The small bowel is lifted anteriorly, and the Ru limb is passed posterior to the small bowel. Towards the pancreas graft, a duodeno jejunostomy is performed concluding the synchronous pancreas kidney transplant.